play five out space and DHOs and they really try to, um, you know, just break you down off the dribble and, um, you know, hope you uh, make mistakes. And, um, you know, we had our hands full the first three quarters and, you know, we kind of got it back in the fourth and um, took control in overtime. Thank you. Elliot. Oh, um, hi. Just wanted to ask, um, this is third night in a row. LeBron has played more than 40 minutes. Um, do you see him getting tired at all? I mean, obviously you want him out there, but, you know, thinking long-term, is it better, you know, ideally to, for him to be playing less minutes? Um, I mean, I mean, you, you heard it from him, um, uh, you know, being tired is just in your head. Um, you know, if you, if you put your mind to it, um, you know, you don't really see yourself getting too too tired, and um, you know that that's always been his mindset through his unbelievable career, and um, you know that dude's a beast. So um, you know, if he says he's not tired, he doesn't get tired. He doesn't get tired. Okay, right, last question, Kahari Jones. Hey, what's going on, Kyle? Uh, I wanted to ask you. Uh, Frank had mentioned like it's a marathon earlier, you know, just what you guys is just to get back to playing, you know, at a, at a, at a high level. Can you just elaborate, elaborate on what that means to you? Just being on the marathon. Just... Um, man, it's just uh, life is a marathon. Um, you know, you're going to have highs, you're going to have lows, uh, you know, just got to stick to the script and, um, you know, keep it pushing, you know, life, life goes, no matter if you win championships the next day, got to go prove yourself again. Uh, if you lose, you got to go prove yourself again. So, um, you know, you know, it's a never ending cycle. All right. Thanks. Kyle.